Ready? What's up everybody welcome back to another video I'm actually shooting this one before the Road King video goes up the Road King video went up and then this one's going up I actually just posted today my headlight install video so I'm ahead of schedule and filming videos right now because the weather's nice and I'm getting out here and filming my, some of these rides before uh, you know we start getting a bunch of rain or it gets cold again and I won't have footage to film so I'm filming a bunch right now <laughs> so I got like two or three videos lined up to edit and get posted for you guys here within the next week so I hope you guys are liking them if you do hit the like button if uh, you want to see something else done with this bike or you know you want to talk with Johnny G or little D let me know in the comments I'm trying to convince this man right here to get a GoPro cause he's thinking about making a channel and doing the same thing you know motorcycle stuff rides with the helmet and cam and everything so you know mention in the comments if you want to see Johnny G do a YouTube channel like this. He doesn't create a channel. Hopefully we can still get him to get a GoPro and we can get the Senna's and do dual vlogs on my channel. You know, footage from his view, footage from my point of view. We can carry on the conversation about the motorcycles, future videos, you know, whatnot. Right now we're riding up one of my favorite hills. This here's Corden Pike. Uh, transition between New Albany, Indiana and Georgetown, Indiana. It's a great hill to ride on, especially in the middle of summer when the roads are hot, your tires are hot. Oh, you can really get in it on these turns. We're still coming out of winter with your salt and gravel on roads, so you can't really hit them as hard as you want or would like to, but and when you got a car in front of you, you definitely can't hit them as hard as you want to because oh, they're going to pull over for because they go slow. They look like they're gonna pull over for us. All right, here it is. this nice for those of you who don't know who are subscribed to the channel and watching my videos I'm from southern Indiana about 15 minutes from Louisville Kentucky or uh, Kentucky Derby if any of y'all ever heard of Kentucky Derby I'm sure a lot of you have <laughs> I'm like 15 20 minutes from there southern Indiana though
man, it's a nice ride. Yeah, it's not a very big hill, but it's big enough to have some fun on. You know, it's just a constant snake all the way up the hill. We have a lot of fun going up it. There's a lot more roads than this that one that we cruise on. It's twisty. That one's one of our favorites. And we're going to one of our favorite favorite uh chill spots. That's where I did a lot of my videos last year. A lot of montage videos on the bike. I did in this spot. Great spot to film some montage videos on motorcycles. Ready when you are. I think the bike's coming along pretty good. Got the headlight done, got the bars done, got the exhaust, tuner, stage one. Now I just need a uh, LED turn signals and brake lights and I'll be ready to rock and roll man like Johnny G's bike he got he has the LED brake lights and turn signals on his they look so much better than the standard bulb that the Harley put on the these 18 street glides I think they may do LED now on the 2020s and 2021s I'm not sure but on the 18s they didn't so you gotta upgrade that yourself all right now we're going back down this hill that we just came up where it's like eight to ten turns back to back going down is just as fun as coming up Johnny G usually scrapes his pegs going down on this thing I don't know if he's gonna hit it as hard with you know the salt and gravel still on the roads, but I've hit mine once or twice. He he almost hits his every time. His bike does sit a little lower than mine, but we hit him pretty hard. Yeah, this is a touring bike, but it still likes to get into the twisties. <clears throat> if 
future videos starts warming up getting hot you'll see us hit this road a couple times and when I say hit it we hit it it's a pretty good ride it's temperature 68 degrees outside feels great all right guys thanks for watching if you like the video give it a thumbs up um, hopefully you come back and watch some more if not uh, thanks for watching this one anyway if uh, you want to see more just go ahead and hit the subscribe button and we'll see you on the next one later guys